Morning everyone, this is Dan Bird with the National Weather Service Office in Jackson, Mississippi. So as some highlights, the Pearl River at Jackson is cresting today. Um, there could be some isolated to scattered storms this afternoon, but better chances for showers and thunderstorms on Tuesday. Highs will mainly be in the upper 80s through much of the week, with today being the hottest day. So the Pearl River at Jackson is cresting today at uh, 34.37 feet. And it looks like um, the upstream sites have already crested and the downstream sites will crest uh, tonight through Wednesday. But the Pearl River at Jackson is at its crest and will begin a slow fall tonight. And that fall will continue uh, through midweek and into the end of the week. So for today, I'm expecting isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms with the best chance for storms over the northeast Louisiana parishes and over southwest Mississippi. Highs today are going to range from the upper 80s into the low 90s. Today we do have strong high pressure ridging over the area, but that will begin to weaken as a cold front approaches the area from the north. For tomorrow, will be the best chance we have for uh, showers and thunderstorms through pretty much most of the week uh, until we get to this weekend. Uh, you're going to have uh, scattered chances of storms north of I-20 and scattered and numerous chances for storms generally along and south of I-20 on Tuesday. Highs are generally going to be in the upper 80s on Tuesday. For Wednesday, a cold front will move across the area as high pressure ridging builds in. That will usher in some drier air. And it looks like as we get in from Wednesday, Thursday, and or Friday, we're generally going to see mostly dry conditions, but there will continue to be at least isolated chances for storms with the best chances in South Mississippi. As we get into the weekend, though, a cold front will begin to push back north across the area and that will increase tropical moisture across the area. So we will see increased chances for showers and thunderstorms on Saturday and Sunday. This is a seven day precipitation potential across the area and most of the rainfall that you see here will be tomorrow and then once again as we get into uh, Saturday and Sunday. There is just some slight potential for some heavier rainfall as we get into next weekend but that's something that uh, we'll just have to continue to monitor. National Center, Hurricane Center outlook for the next five days shows uh, not too much going on in the Gulf right now. Over the uh, over east of Nicaragua, there's a, a small chance for formation with a cluster of thunderstorms over those regions. But right now, the best chance for any type of development will be over the southern central Atlantic. And currently, that if it does develop, it's forecast to move to the northwest. So thanks for viewing. That's one of Service Jackson's multimedia weather briefings. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call.